Asante sana. Asante sana. Nataka niwasalimu tena kwa jina la Yesu Kristo hamjambo. Hamjambo tena. Yangu yatakuwa machache vile ambavyo nilikuwa nimewaambia hapo mbeleni. Mimi nafanya kazi kwa karibu sana na bwana Joshua Kawino. Huyu Kawino vile mumeambiwa yeye ndiye anasimamia fedha za chama cha ODM. Na tangu hiki chama kianzishwe we have been audited all of these years and we are very proud of the work that Kawino does. ODM has never ever received an adverse audit question by the office of the auditor general. Mupigie huyu mwanaume makofi. Number two, many people don't know, lakini kwa ODM kuna wale watu wanaitwa fathers of the party. Wenye chama, wale ambao wanaaminika na kila mtu kwamba hawawezi kukigura ama kukipotosha chama cha ODM. Na huyu mzee Kawino ni moja wao. He is an elder not only in the party but even in church. And Mr. Kawino, many people don't know when some people ask me, Sifuna, where do you get these things you say on TV? Where do you get them from? Many people don't know that I have advisors, very close advisors, who tell me that on this one, this is the position you should take. And Bwana Kawino is one of them. Mimi nataka leo niseme, mzee mweshimiwa uburu odinga, menifanyia kazi yangu ikakuwa raisi sana. Kwa sababu kuna mambo wamesema hapa, mimi ni kisema uwa wanasema sifuna Ni kijana mtundu, kijana mdogo hana eshima kwa wazee Leo, wamepata mtu mzee kuwashinda awaambie ukweli Kwa sababu sifuna kisema ruto wapunguze uongo Wanasema uyo kijana hana eshima Uburu wamesema nini? Hamesema ruto wapunguze ushuru Apunguze garama ya maisha Na apunguze uongo, sindio? Hamesema ajasema Sasa huyo ni mzee kunishinda na ni mzee kushinda ruto na anasema the same thing. Sinamaanisha hiyo ndio ukweli? Sasa mimi nataka nichukue fursa hii bwana Kawino. Unajua kuna wale watu ambao unafanya kazi nao kwa kikaribu kwa headquarters ya chama. Tumetembea nao wengi sana hapa. If you know you are from the National Secretariat of ODM, just stand up please because of time you can see members of parliament lining here. They want to leave the entire National Secretariat of ODM is here, Bwana Kawino, led by our executive director himself, Mr. Oduoro Nguyen. And these are the people who work day by day with you, side by side. If time had allowed, I would, allowed, I would have allowed two or three of them to speak. But I wanted to allow some members of parliament who are here. Senator Kajuang, please bear with me. You can see our colleagues are already taken up on stage here. Uh, Honorable uh, Oluoch of Madare. If I don't do him this favor, when we go back to Nairobi, atanivuruga. So, Mweshimiwa, where is he? He has already gone. Okay. Then, without further ado then, I want to take this opportunity to say two things. Honorable Wandai, we are going back to Parliament tomorrow. I want you in the National Assembly to remain steadfast. Kwa sababu kuna kazi lazima tufanya. Na sisi, kama wajumbe wa ODM, tunajulikana kuwa wajumbe wa msimamo kitu cha kwanza tuliwaambia wakati wa mjadala wa IBC kwamba refari hawezi chaguliwa na upande moja tuliwaambia hatukuwaambia sasa hawakusikia wakati ule wakaenda na kiburi yao na kujipiga kifua ati ni wengi kwa bunge wakakwama leo hii wakati ambapo walirudi baada ya wananchi kuwasukuma kwa barabara wakasema tuketi pamoja tukatuma opio wandaye huko tukatuma kalonzo msioka kule wakatengeneza ripoti hiyo ripoti inasema huwezi katika mchezo wa kidemokrasia kuwa mchezaji na pia ukue refari pale wale waliona game ya jana usiku ya Cote d'Ivoire na Nigeria ingekubalika kweli watu wa Cote d'Ivoire ndio wachague refa haingewezekana so hata kwa hii IBC tunataka kuambia Ruto huwezi chagua refa peke yako Na hii kitu ndiye mebaki peke yake. Once we sort out the question of IABC, mimi kama katibu wenu, nimetembea na baba Kenya mzima. I have no doubt in my mind, Ruto is going to be a one-term president. I can assure you. The people of Kenya, the people of Kenya are going to put a stop to this very terrible experiment they got themselves into in 2022. 
na nawaambia na wahakikishia kwa sababu kila mkenya ameona kazi imeshinda watu hata wao wenyewe wanakubali kazi imewashinda ukisikia kule central kenya wanasema sasa wanataka kubadilisha kikosi game ijafika minute 20 wanataka kupiga substitution mchezaji wao wanasema huu gashagwa wameelewa kwa nini baba anamuita gashetha kwa sababu amekuwa mzigo kwao pia wanasema sasa wajaribu ndindi nyoro ama sijui walete waiguru kwa sababu kitumbua kimeingia mchanga hawa jamaa sisi tunawaambia for as long as we get the IBC right i can assure you hawa watu wanaenda nyumbani walete ndindi walete waiguru ama walete nani wanaenda wapi nyumbani kwa hivyo sisi tukirudi bunge mheshimiwa pio kule chini wewe sisitiza kwamba sisi tunataka hilo swala la IBC litiliwe mkazo na kule kwa senate mimi pamoja na seneta wenu shupavu hapa ambaye ni chairman wangu wa PAC mheshimiwa Kajwang tutahakikisha kwamba pia sisi na hiyo ripoti imetiliwa maanani tuwe na referee ambaye anaweza kusimamia mpira pasi na kuwalau watu wafanye ukora hapa nyuma kwa hayo mengi nataka nimkaribishe seneta wenu ama nani yako hapo oh mheshimiwa Oron wamesema kawino ameniambia ni hijack program ni